I'm going to be uh, downloading and installing this program, uh, and the program is called Boot Racer. So this is where we're going to download it off. Now we could actually go to Boot Racer's official website and download it from there, but this was the link, so we're going to follow exactly to the T. So I heard about this program while I was trolling through one of the uh, PC magazines that I read. So guys, this is the Boot Racer website and you can see, let's have a quick glance through the website, monitors, boot time, control startup programs, all very good stuff. It looks like a very simple user interface. Now this program originally came out in 2013, about three years ago. So, but this is the uh, 6.0 version that I saw in the uh, PC magazine. Um, so as you can see here, it's lightweight and it really is. It's the, the program itself is only about, it's under four megabytes. So yeah, it's pretty cool. So the main benefit of this, and the only reason I decided to make a video on this, is you don't have to go into your startup programs, mess with the settings, with the power management, things like that. So if you're not confident enough to do that, I mean, you can watch many videos online on how to speed up your boot time. Oh, what's this? Uh, who has the fastest computer? Uh, is holding a contest for the fastest booting computer. I'm sure uh, some of the uh, crazy exotic system builders will absolutely obliterate this on boot time. But I think this is more generally looking at the uh, home user or office user. It all looks very good. So we're going to go ahead and install the app. So now, as you can see, this is Boot Racer 6.0. And we're going to download the English version. English US. There it is. Racer has been successfully installed so we're going to hit finish and this is the uh, file boot racer was modified do you wish to update it to the archives no so here's the PC this is the uh, interface screen boot time test advanced like so we're just going to take a look at the uh, interface that we can see so at the moment it's saying pre-boot I do have a pre-boot so the motherboard uh, manufacturer the vendor comes up the Windows boot time is 18 seconds password timeout it loses six seconds on the uh, windows password when you're typing in your logon and then to desktop so from pre-boot to desktop is 27 seconds and it ranks at a score of 45.78 uh, under the advanced tab startup controls so you can actually click onto this and it shows you a list of programs that start up so you can hit refresh see if anything else has been added on that's my usb 3.0 driver I've got an expansion card and so and so Adobe files I'm not going to mess with any of that so that's that so the next part what we're going to do is run a boot time test so let's check this out we're going to record on this and I'm going to show you how this program works and see if we can beat our 45.718 seconds uh, boot result score and our 27 seconds to desktop so here we go guys so I'm going to click boot time test as you can see here, and Boot Racer will measure your Windows boot time on the next reboot. Uh, would you like to uh, restart your computer now? I'm going to hit yes. And as you can see, the PC is restarting. So there you are, guys. Motherboard, this is the pre boot. So, very cool projector. Check out the video soon. So here you go, Windows. I'm going to type in the password as fast as I can. Now I want to show you guys, and here we go. There we are. So now that that's loaded, what you should get is Boot Racer should open up in this corner and uh, give you a score. So as you can see, something's loading. Windows is almost done. So we're good to go. And as you can see, it doesn't have an average. Uh, what is this info tab? Well, you have a new personal record. That's great. So we're gonna go to no more. And we have, see our desktop time is still 26, but it did result in a slight improvement in the uh, overall bench. But it's nice to know that you can actually improve your boot time. The program works well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. 
and uh, I'm going to do a lot more of these. If you have any questions, drop me a comment, and if you know of any other apps, let me know. So guys, until next time. <laughs>